Coming up next, a UFC flyweight division matchup. Well, at one point, Brandon Moreno had a 10-fight winning streak to his credit, and man, did he burst on the scene in the UFC, coming off of that 24th season of The Ultimate Fighter. Not a ton was expected of him on the show. Now the expectations are lofty, given what he did against Louis Smolka and then Ryan Benoit inside the octagon. Nine wins by way of submission. The rear naked choke is a big weapon for him. Very much a fast starter as well, something the opposition has got to be mindful of here tonight. This guy has toughness that you cannot teach. He has an incredible ability to absorb punishment and the mental toughness to come back from devastating situations. So here he is, a very accomplished striker, finally making the walk to the octagon tonight. Gotta think he'll be interested, of course, in keeping this fight standing in his wheelhouse. And he's got the takedown defense to keep this fight where he wants it, no doubt. He'll be looking to put on a striking clinic here tonight. This guy is a great striker. What he wants to do is land hard and early, get the respect of his opponent, and avoid any grappling exchanges. Flyweight fight. Well, at least on paper, what an even matchup here. Everything between these two fighters is nearly identical coming in here tonight. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC flyweight division. It's for Lucy first. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 14 wins, 5 losses. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Brandon, the assassin baby, Moreno! And now to his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a kickboxer. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Mexico City, Mexico, Magnifico. All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's ready? about to go down right go. now. Here we go. Oh! Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? And he's looking for that left. Big right hand lands. Oh. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Oh, nice strike landed there by Brandon Moreno. And he's going with the knee to the body. Oh, here, Joe. knee. Body kick, look at that. Oh, straight right. Lands a kick. Oh, a 
and he connects there. Superman punch lands, Joe. You can tell he's worked on that. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the butt. Strong inside leg kick. And there he swung with a haymaker. That one hurt. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Kick to the body by Brandon Moreno. Well, the strike lands, but he is visibly fatigued, Joe, and as such, not doing a whole lot of damage at this point in the fight. Tries for a low single. Going to the body there with the right kick. Moreno gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Oh! Wow! He's hanging on here, but he is in big, big trouble. Under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here. Try to establish that jab. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Oh, oh he nailed him! Yeah. And just like that, the fight is over. And here's the end. Bruce Buffer has your official.